Hey, I've noticed that there's been a huge drop off in productivity lately. Well, you know, maybe if you gave me some incentive, like an occasional incentive. bonus or bonus. a good job, I'd work uh, hard. You know, bonuses are typically for hard workers. Well, you, you know, know what? I've been doing some thinking, oh, and no. I'm thinking this job sucks. Sucks? What? This job you know what? Suck? No, you suck. Job. I quit. I left my job behind because my peace of mind was more important. They want my soul, but they couldn't afford it. Now I'm slapping tall without a car, yet I'm in the driver's seat. I feel complete, triumphant in the face of defeat. And when I reach my home, I'm gonna tell my girl, pick her up, give her a twirl. She'll rejoice, I'm sure. She was supportive, but asked me what I could afford if I wasn't working. That's when my dome started hurting. I reached in my pocket to count my ends. It was like $15 and about 20 cents. It was singles, but I said it was a stack of tens. I lied again and told her soon we're gonna own the Benz. Then she went to run some errands and I took some aspirin. In the moments of this glorious day, I was basking. Cold chilling, watching Three's company and mashing, maxing in a professional fashion. Look. You seem way too comfortable being unemployed. Okay. I haven't even seen you okay. look for I understand a job. what you're saying, but I'm going to throw one keyword at you here. Keyword? Opportunity. Huh. You know, now that I'm not working, you and I have the opportunity to hang out. And then when we're done hanging out, we get to hang out even more. Oh, this is going to be awesome. great. Check it out. Look forward to that. Week one, I chilled and had crazy fun. Week two, where's my crew? Come by for blunts and some brew. Weeks three and four, repeating. Weeks one and two galore, there's a knock on my door. Oh shit, it's the landlord. It's first words you know we can't stand for. People paying me late, provide me with a definite date of payment. I tried hard not to look complacent. My dome was vacant, but I knew I had to name it. I said, give me till the end of the week. My girl said, sweet. Then she turned her back and wouldn't speak. The pressure's building up in the house. Household. She's real sick of carrying the whole load. I can tell she's gonna explode. Who's this calling my phone? Hey, what's poppin', baby? Hey, what's hey, what up, bro? Bro, what's crackin', man? Chillin', trying to come through. What's oh, up? wait, come over here. Yeah, oh, over there. Oh, no, come right back, oh, compadre. My God. Uh, no, this is a no fly zone, my oh, brother. You fraud. Come it on, is all on, on the block. Oh, my girl is pissed at me, man. My dude, you know uh, I got the trees and those 40 ounces. No, fuck all that, man. No. Ah, uh, you buggin'. Three months pass, and I got no plan of recourse. Remorse, my fiance already wants a divorce. It's not because my pockets weren't fat, she's not like that. She tried to have my back, but my attitude is whack. I've been crazy slack, leaving dishes in the big stack. Grease all on the placemats, didn't change the litter for the cats again. Plus, I've been chilling with my friends instead of showing her respect for all the effort she spends. When she looks at me now, she sees a burden. A young man uncertain and a silly rap career closed curtains. I became guilt, and she's frustration and anger. Our communications imitating desire. She's leaving, but I'm too full of pride to chase after. Denying the fact that she could really be Casper. Chilling on the couch and feeling like a bastard. I guess I should have got my act together much faster. All right, you know what, babe? You you, you want to leave? You really want to leave? Yep. Then yep, you I know, do leave. who am I to stop you? You no know, you doubt. go on and do your thing. But I can't believe you want to leave all this behind. Leave and all of you know, behind. you walk out that door, there's no turning back. Except, uh, <laughs> currently I don't have the funds to travel, so I will. Actually, be located here uh, uh, before the eviction. And if you want to call me, I would gladly, of course, uh, come meet you for brunch. Okay, your treat.